You're too late. Speech time's over. I'm not here to give a speech. I don't actually know you that well. Which means I'm seeing things a little clearer. What are you gonna do? Dissect me? I'm gonna do something Josie wouldn't. Clever. But you know, if you're trying to distract me from your partner that's sneaking up on me, you should know I have, like, really good hearing. Especially because you're a mouth breather. You know, if you wanted to put me to sleep, you could have just talked. Okay, look, which one of you wants to die first? Neither of them. Why don't you pick on someone your own size? You, do your little blinky thing and get my girlfriend out of here. Big kids need a chat. What took you so long? Performance anxiety? Well, I needed the proper motivation. Oh, don't tell me it was what's her name being in danger that brought you out. You've gone soft. It's actually exactly what Josie needed to let me loose. I'm here to put you down. Minus the boxing ring, of course. You up for a rematch? Absolutely. Finally, someone around here gets it. I mean, you being here proves my point. When it's time to fight, Josie has to rely on her strong half. That, that's like me. Oh. I'm not here to fight you. I'm just here to snap my fingers. You remember Jade, right? Former student, actually a lot like you. Headstrong, moody. Questionable taste in men. She was so scared of her trauma. She turned off her humanity, but I turned it back on. Just like this. 